We're learning more about the people who were inside the Applebee's last night, including the victims. Sarah Maki is live at Kinlock Fire Department with more. Sarah? Yeah, that's absolutely right. Chief Kevin Stewart, he says that this department is like family, and right now they're really hurting for one of their own. That would be a firefighter, our Lydia Bufford, who is now in critical condition at last check, all because she was in the wrong place at the wrong time, just having dinner with one of her colleagues. The 20 year old, she had just wrapped up an EMS, EMT training class after joining the department in January, and Chief Stewart says that every day she's just been trying to get better. That she had just left that class with a colleague, was grabbing Having dinner with Captain Darian Meeks, who wasn't hurt in the shooting, but he was able to direct first responders to help Bufford and also to help the other victims. Those women are Lakeisha Finch, who was wounded, and Kimberly Ratliff Penton, who was killed in the shooting. This department, the chief says, has never been through anything like this before. She brings a lot of joy to the station, and uh, a lot of us, all of us, are very fond of her. All of us look at her as either a little sister, a niece, or a daughter. And, uh, you know, we're just heartbroken that this happened to her. The department has organized a GoFundMe for the Bufford family. If you want to donate, you can find that on our app or on our website, ksdk.com. Just look for this story under the As Seen on TV section. In Kinlock, Saramaki, five on your side.